to run as a Windows NT service on Windows 2008 R2. Now, in this example, I'm going to monitor this folder here for txt files and uh, print them out. So to do that, go to Options menu, Dash Monitor Setup. Now I'm going to set it to eight every eight seconds. I'm going to monitor the, this path. Cut paste it in, and I'm going to print to this printer here. Make it add to monitor list. So that's all set up, ready to go. Save and exit. Now you can start the service now. But what I want to do, I want to run it under the same account as this, which is administrator. So I'm going to go to NT Service Setup. If I don't do this, it'll run as local system, which might not have access to the printers depending on where they are or files if they're on the network, for example. So I'm going to use current user and type in password for that. And then I'm going to go on to start NT service. And it should be that simple. And then it should, if you're looking task manager, now close this, close this down. So you've got the service running there, and you've got the program running there as well. So as you can see, it's printed those two files. The printer is currently paused. If I copy that file, you'll see it print that test two copy in a minute. You can see the processor going up there. and it's put that file out. So that's a quick example of how to get it to work. Any problems, then if you go into the program and check the NT service log. In there it'll say it's got a log on failure or something like that. And you can also go into view services If you look under here, you'll find the Bash and Premium Law Edition and whether it started or not. And you can change the log on information in there if you want to verify it and try to get it to work that way. Other than that, just give it a try.